All right, we're checking out the only game where the best way to make friends as a cute little candy monster is to start a quest for delicious treasures. It's Cut the Rope 2, made by Zeptolab. Yeah, real original uh. Zeptolab, guys. <laughs> you may remember Cut the Rope 1. Uh. Well, there's a Cut the Rope 2. <laughs> and now... <laughs> God. Our candy monster has to become oh. even more of a quest consumer than he was before. This game is also called Om Nom's Quest, because I kind of mentioned it, but... Yeah, let's click play, and let's start at the forest, yes. Let's go to level one. I feel like level one is kind of like the easiest level around here. Collect three stars. No problemo, let's do it. Oh, Om Nom's falling. Om Nom! <laughs> As always, just like all the other cut the rope games, you have to slide your finger to cut the rope and feed the kitty to Om Nom. There we go! Yes! I got all three stars! Bravo for me! That level was obviously too easy. Let's go to level two! This one is too easy as well. Watch this. You just need to cut this one, then the other one, and you're done. Like, that level was so easy! <laughs> yeah. Okay, the levels might seem easy at first, but the more levels you go to, the harder they will get. See, like this one. It's a bit more challenging because you have to keep the, band the candy balanced. Yeah, and sometimes you've got to have patience when playing with this game. Because sometimes you might have to cut the rope or just react to things at a certain time. And, yeah, that is Cut the Rope 2, Om Nom's Quest's ah. purpose. Alrighty then, let's do level 4. Oh, sorry, Om Nom. Wanted, Om Nom. I'm sorry, okay. I'm sorry, but I had to hit you, Om Nom. I needed to complete level 4. Well, that's okay. Alright. Level 5. It's the first level with three medals. Ah. There's a balloon, and you have to pop it with your finger. Just like the bubbles in the original cut the rope. This is just the beginning. This is just the star medal. The fruit medal. This is where you collect all your fruits over here. Collect 20 fruits or more. So if you collect less, then you won't be able to complete that mission. Yeah. Yeah, so easy. <laughs> collect zero stars. Sounds like a challenge, but I've been doing it for a long time. There we go. <laughs> so if you want to collect zero stars, just do this at the right time. So no stars means mission accomplished. I know, that's really weird because you have to collect three stars at the first medal, but this is the challenge medal. It's a challenge medal. It's where you where you get challenges. The zero, that's where the zero star thing comes from. Anyway, speaking of stars, let's get more. Level six. Second level with three medals. Oh, there are three balloons this time. Let's see. So, um, popping balloons is actually very confidential because you have to either pop them at the right time or just be a lookout for them because if you pop it at the wrong time, the Nom Nom might not be able to feast on his delicious meal. But don't worry, I think we've got that all covered. Fifteen fruits, really? I was about to say, you're collecting fruits quick. Yeah, 15 fruits. I was actually surprised. That's all I need, just 15 fruits and that's it. Yeah, got over 15. 23 out of 15 fruits collects, because why not? Here's the challenge medal. Collect three stars in under 12 seconds. Yeah, don't worry, I could do that. Oh! 
the timer. Don't worry, I know how to do this. Of course, I'm a professional at these missions. So if you feel like you can't do that mission, don't do it. Yeah, just try your best. Yeah, I'm a trained professional for the challenge medals. So just letting you know. And then we come to level seven. Now, this is the part where you get your first power-up balloons. Like, I don't have enough coins to purchase 15 balloons, but... Once you pop that balloon, a free balloon will be available, and the hand will tell you to press it. Press on the candy. That's so cool. But sadly, for the fruit and for the challenge medals, you have to purchase other balloons. Because look what happens if I pop the balloon. See? It, it does not let you choose another balloon. So yeah, that's kind of a shame. 23 out of 24 fruits. So that's why I have to tell you, you, you need to get enough candy coins in order to purchase balloons. Same thing with the challenge medal. Collect zero stars. Even though this might be easy, I think I know how to do this without purchasing balloons. Plus, I don't have enough coins, so that's irrelevant. Alright, let me just... Oh, alright. Wait, no, that's not what I was meant to do. I'm sorry. I was meant to do this. Yeah! Okay, so I guess for the challenge medal, you don't need to purchase balloons. But for the fruit medal, I'm sorry to say this, but you need to purchase some type of balloon that will send the candy up. Maybe we could just do this. Oh, no! So close. See, the thing is, the sad thing in Cut the Rope 2 is that they made getting a... They made getting the fruits a bit more difficult. And it's sometimes challenging feeding Om Nom. Yeah. Most of the time it's challenging, but some of the time, only for professionals, it's like a breeze. Oh, 26 out of there. I was so close. Yeah, maybe we can't do that. Very quick. What about just one fruit? Still not to Om Nom? Maybe we could... Do this instead. Collect zero fruits with the balloon and then pop the balloon. 24 exactly. Uh, like why, man? Why is getting the fruits so difficult? Yeah, man, yeah. Just keep going. That's all I have to say, man. What? Okay, we're just going to skip this. It's going to take a while. Out of balloons, really? It's in the tutorial here. All right, let's go to level eight. The first level where you unlock a chest. I've already unlocked it, but you would get a prize if you would win that level. Or at least one of the medals. If not all the medals, that's okay. But I think this is easy. So let's go for the this balloon. And this and this balloon. We're basically trying to keep the candy balanced until it's time to feed Om Nom. Like this. See, now the candy's not balanced. See? Alright, let's go to the fruit met. 30 fruits? My gosh. So I have to collect 15 fruits and then 15 more just to achieve my mission. My gosh. These missions are sometimes pretty hard. Huh? Yeah. But don't worry, since the candy is kind of balanced right now, I think we could get all those fruits. Wait, what happened? Uh, how come the candy is stuck inside the balloon and now it's going to fall down? Wow. <sighs> all right, let's try this again. I am a really good expert at these challenge and fruit medals, but I never thought this level was so hard. What? The material made the candy fell down. I mean, fall down. No worries. After you completed that level, you would unlock your prize. Collect zero stars, I was about to say. Uh, it was very a challenge. Medal for me. 
And I was about to say I only collected one star. This one's really this one's really a challenge. There we go. I don't know how many balloons I have popped. But I think it's like a certain number of balloons I popped. Alright. After you complete level 7, you would get another chest. Then level 9. Here we go. Alright. So there's a balloon over here. Oh, it's carrying the material up. Now, you don't have to pop a balloon, but I'm just popping it. Yeah, baby. Yeah, we're feeding it. It's feeding time. 31 fruits or more. My gosh. These fruit medals are now challenging. You know how I said I'm, I'm an expert at these medals? Well, these medals are not even that easy anymore. Like, my gosh. Yeah, right on the edge. The candy did not fall off. I was lucky. Collect zero star. When is this collect zero stars thing going to stop? I, I collected zero stars for such a long time. And honestly, collecting zero stars is kind of one of the hardest challenges. Oh, oh no. See, that's what I mean. It's one of the hardest challenges. Oh, don't collect it. Don't collect it. There we go. Yeah, collecting zero stars is pretty much um, the most difficult, one of the most difficult challenges on the forest part of this section because you have to figure out how to feed the kitty to Omnom without even collecting anything. All right. After you're done, you're going to go watch a cartoon and get free coins. Um... I don't want to watch the cartoon because it's due to copyright claims, um, so we'll just say no. Even though they won't strike me, I, I just don't want to watch a cartoon. Plus, it's, it's, it's a waste of time, but don't worry, I'll show you what that little guy means. Oh! Oh, no. Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. Sorry, I accidentally clicked yes and... The whole thing just went off. I didn't know I was clicking this. Alright. Oh, level 10 is the first level of where you will be seeking help from a friend. Like, Roto, this is the friend that's helping you. Roto is a helicopter mommy. He slash she, I don't know what gender it is. But Roto could carry the candy, Omnom, and other materials. So just tap Omnom or Roto to let Omnom go. Then he'll eat the candy. Yeah, baby, yeah. Collect 39 fruits or more. Yeah. Now, that's cooking. Now we're cooking. You see, getting the fruits is also kind of a challenge compared to that zero star challenge medal. Because it's, it's just the same, like, difficulty level. Collect one star. Finally, the zero stars thing is over. Because I was about to say, collecting zero stars in here is impossible. But collecting one star is possible. If you drop on them at just the right time, you'll get only one star. Then your medal is achieved. Yes. Alright, level 11. Once you complete that one, you'll get a big blue chest with another oh. prize. Now, this one is kind of interesting. If we place this barrel here, Roto will just carry the candy up. Oh, oh, sorry, I'm sorry, Bob. We got all three stars. Let's go. All right. Collect 41 fruits or more. Mm, that's two more fruits. All right. All right. We're doing good so far. What? 39? Are you serious right now? I only collected 39 out of 41 fruits. That's fine. At least I tried my best. Collect free stars in under 6 seconds. I can certainly do that. It takes me less than 6 seconds to figure out this level, really. Because all you do is just do this and then you go. See? One second here. I, I was a second left to waste, but... um. It's not really much of wasting. <laughs> so let's just 
Go to level 12. You earned your prize, but you go to level 12. Wow, I needed a lot less skill here. <laughs> that, one, that one was too easy. 37 fruits. My gosh. I sometimes fail at this one because there's just not enough fruits for me to just go over fruit. 36? I was so close. I only needed one more fruit left. Let's see if I can actually do it again. How about, let's just do this. Oh, so close. Don't worry, at least I tried my best. Right? Because if you don't try, you'll never win. Collect two stars, beat the timer. Under three seconds. Wait, no, I only collected one star, you cheeky um, um. Yeah, second left to race. But I have completed the mission. Thanks to Om Nom for being cheeky and for eating the candy when he was not supposed to. I was, I was, my goal was to get two stars, but I only got one star with Om Nom feeding the candy. Level 13, that's how old I am, 13 years old. Let's go to my age. What? <sighs> my age is so complicated. It's literally like all these barrels here, Om Nom is it's kind of, kind of trapped in there, too. Oh, oh almost! Come on! Yeah! How did Om Nom even reach the candy when he was half a meter above it? I don't know. Maybe his mouth is kind of like a super sucker. 36? And I don't think I'll ever achieve this. Or will I? No, I won't achieve this. <laughs> It's always like, well, or will I? And then I don't achieve it. Collect zero stars. Easy mode. Oh, yeah. Collecting zero stars is easy mode now. Challenge complete. All right. So there are challenges, too. Complete five different levels, not collecting any stars. So there are challenges you can do. 20 coins. Yeah. Complete a level in three different locations. Teleport on them together with the candy and... The five different levels, not collecting any stars, completing one, and I already completed that one. Unfortunately, I don't have enough teleporters, but no worries. At least we got level 13 completed. Now 14. <coughs> what? Oh my gosh. Just when I was about to say that these levels take a lot of skill and practice, I think I'm not joking. Yeah, 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 that's a whole lot bigger. All right, 26 fruits. All right, let's give it a go. This time, cut this rope. What happened? Oh, how come the candy just fell down from over here? I thought Om Nom's mouth was a super sucker, just like I mentioned earlier in another previous level. Alright, it's time to face the facts. No, just joking. I'm not going to like Alright. Come on! Come on, Candy. We're so close! Oh, I'm so close. Uh, I'll not succeed. Or will I? No, I'll not succeed. Yeah. Alright. Let me try one more time. Come on! Okay, I'm gonna skip this part. Yeah, sorry, but collect one star, okay? I think collecting one star might be super easy. Alright, let's just collect this baby over here. This bad boy. Wait, what? I collected two stars! <sighs> Cheeky me, I was supposed to collect one star, not two stars. Man, these levels are so complicated. Oh, wait. Wait, I might actually fail. Where will I? No, I fail. Yeah, it's just that these levels just take a lot of practice to ace. Level 15. The first level with air cushions. Tap the air cushions to blow objects away. 
at that. It's it's like a little swing. Om Nom's having fun in his own little swing. Yay! Then cut the rope. Om Nom will fall from his little swing. Collect the last star and feast on his delicious treasure. Fifty-four fruits. No wonder this is a swing. If you collect a variety of fruits just by swinging in an intense movement. And then he swings so fast that he falls to end his swinging quest. In order to... Oh, well, only 49 out of 54 fruits. Not bad, but it turns out there's actually another power next to the balloon power. It's a bomb. You can tap anywhere on the screen and the fruits will literally just come to you. Yeah. It works every time. Well, only if you're not interested in bombs and it doesn't work or is it, it's not comfortable for you, but whatever. I think the bombs are really good. They're neat looking. Sometimes I fail a level with bombs just because I mistake a level for being hard. And But then when I really try it out, it's so easy. So I just have to waste superpowers accidentally. Yes! Woo! I did it! With a superpower, cut zero ropes. Kind of interesting. Now, this is actually really easy because I think I already pointed that tip out to you when I was collecting the fruits. See, our mom fell down. No ropes cut. So you had to blow him hard that he'll fall off the swing and you can't cut any ropes. So yeah, that's my little tip here. Now the next level, and then this might take a long while. So this level, that's it for the forest, and then we're going to go to the sandy dam, okay? I'll tell you what the sandy dam is in a second. Right now, we need to collect some bad stars, baby. Yeah, I love Omnom with his star eyes. When I collect all three stars, he just... He's just... 53 fruits? My gosh. Alright, first thing to do, push Omnom all the way over here. <laughs> I'm sorry, Omnom, but I had to do it. I think he likes it. Alright. Let's cut the rope. Alright, let's get more fruits. Maybe one more? No, I can't collect one more. Oh, come on. I was so close. I need nine more fruits. Oh, wait, actually a lot less but nine fruits. All right, this is my last bomb. I know, but I have to use it wisely. Well, all you other fruits, I hope you enjoy being collected. Yeah, I hope you enjoy being collected, you cheeky fruits. I got you this time. Collect three stars in under six seconds. That one stumped me a little bit. But with enough practice, I was able to do this. Oh, no! Oh, yes. Yeah, I beat the timer. Just when I was about to fail, I succeeded. I guess failure is a huge success. Out of bombs. I know that. All right. I do not want to watch a cartoon and get 30 coins, so no thanks. I am comfortable with the amount of coins I have. Level 25. And then here is Lick. Now, Lick does not actually lick. He's named Lick for a reason. Instead of licking, Lick just grapples or holds on to objects, as I should say, with his tongue. And it keeps the candy safe so that the candy will not fall down. Isn't that kind of weird and interesting? Yeah, he's named Lick for a reason. 17 fruits. No wonder this level is so easy. All right. Just click Lick. I hate that rhymed. Click and Lick. 17 fruits exactly. That is good luck. Collect three stars in under two seconds. Click. Yeah. Woo. Alrighty, baby. Yes. Alright. Level 26. Level 26 is easy, too. Just click on this 
click up the rope. Click on this one. Play all the candy. It's gonna get delivered straight to our mom. All three stars. There we go. All right. 26 fruits. That's actually a, a one in a million. It's level 26, but you need to collect 26 fruits. What are you doing? Oh, hi. This is my sister speaking over here. Hi. Oh, are you on the record video? Yeah, I, I'm screen recording. And you're doing the audio? Um, yeah, I am doing the audio. Collect 26 fruits. That's actually funny because it's level 26 right now and I need to collect 26 fruits. Okay. Yeah. Cut the rope too made getting the fruits so difficult. How come fruit feasting is so hard? Bye. All right. Bye, Sophia. Bye. Oh, I, on, I only collected 24 fruits. Two bye, stars. Bye. bye, Sophia. Two stars. Oh, my gosh. All right. Guess I need to be more prepared for this. But it seems easy. Just... Wait, no. All right. Try again. Only one. Okay. Okay. I think I know what to do now. Just stop, stop. Yeah, yeah, baby. Finally, we got it. After so much practice. Uh, just like I say, practice makes perfect. Well, almost perfect. Just it makes effort. Cut the rope, there's a transformation balloon. The outline means there's an automatic balloon that will automatically appear when candy moves into range. And this is level 33, by the way. Yes, yes, we're doing it. We're doing the job. Level 34. Now, this one's kind of interesting. If you do both the licks... And the candy will just be trapped. He's like, let me out! Shut up and I'll keep speaking. Right. So anyways, just take this other lick. No! What just happened? How come the candy just escaped? Alright, two transformation balloons. That seems special enough. Oh no, it's about to fall off. No, no. Wait, what? Wait, no! Oh, yes. Yes! Yeah, yeah. Just as I thought it was about to turn into red zone, it's actually a green zone. Alright. Next is the junkyard. There is blue! If you tap blue, he could multiply. Watch. See, when you click one blue, there are two blues. Then, when you click two, one of the two blues, you get three blues. Um. Then, when you click one of the three blues, you get four um. blues. And the process just um. keeps going on until there are um. so many blues. Complete a level in three different locations. Yeah, the forest, the sandy dam, the junkyard, yeah. 50 coins! Now I have 323 coins. Anyways, there are 14 fruits I have to collect, so this is so easy. Why did it show me the blue oh. pop-up again? Look! What, Sophia? How's my eyeshadow look? I'm trying to look up for the Barbie movie. Oh, so my sister's going to go see the Barbie movie. Yeah. What? Does my um um eyeshadow look good? Yeah, your eyeshadow looks amazing. Thank you. I like the pink and yellow style. It and, isn't really yellow. We just I didn't put a lot. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry, guys. I was distracted from, from such beautiful fantasy. I, I love you. to see beautiful things. You're welcome. Anyways, let's collect all those things. Come on! Oh, too many blues. Sometimes too many blues might be a too dangerous thing. All right. Um, beat the timer three seconds. This is so easy. Oh my gosh! I did it. Alrighty now, let's go to this level. I don't want to watch the cartoon, but thanks. Level 50 of uh, Cut the Rope 2! This one is interesting. 
Ooh, ah, the blues help to balance the candy. That is so cool. But this Venom is going to eat the whole way through. Yes. Cut zero ropes in under five seconds. My gosh, but I must go pretty fast. Ah, come on. And no ropes cutting. I completed the mission. No ropes are cut. Yeah, none of them are cut. This level kind of struggled me. Level 54. Oh. This one really struggled me. But luckily I got superpowers for that. So we're ju we're going to just skip that level. I just wanted to show you that level because I wanted you to see how my skills were. How good or, and how bad my skills were. Level 59. So if you click the magnet, which is the red and blue thing with the yellow rings, you can actually lift the candy up and magnetize it. Hey, I'm not eat it. When Om Nom eats the candy, or when the candy falls down and Om Nom gets sad, you can't magnetize it anymore. Alright. First of all, magnetize. Second of all, blow Om Nom off. Blow, magnetize. Oh, I didn't even get the star. Oh. Okay, Om Nom, now you can eat it. Thanks for being cheeky, I collected all three stars. One, two, three. Yes, it's as easy as one, two, three. Then, eventually, when Nom Nom has had enough of this di candy digestion, we'll move on to the city park to meet Toss. Toss is kind of like a spring Nami. Um, she will store, like, candy materials and even Nom Nom in her springy thing. Then, you can tap her... To send objects through the air just by bouncing like this. Like a spring. Yeah. Except it's a Nami, not an actual spring. 21 fruits. I think this is easy. 21 fruits exactly. That's a good luck charm. Beat the timer. Three seconds. World record. Three seconds. Wow. I beat the level before it even counted down to two. That was quick. I love how Toss's springy thing is just so quick to just react to it. Alright. Now the stars are moving. Alright. You have to be careful when stars are moving. Because if stars move out of place, then you might not get the stars at the right time. 54 fruits. You're kidding me, right? Yeah. It, it's not really kidding me. Wait, no! I'm gonna collect more! Alright, let's collect more. How about if we do it just Om Nom first? Yeah, let's do it with just Om Nom first. Wait, what just happened? Oh, how come Om Nom was bouncing and then he hid behind Toss? My gosh, what just happened? There? Oh my god! It happened again. Uh, that's one of the best things I experienced. I didn't even know I was doing that. Oh no! Oh, I got 60 fruits though. That's not that bad. We'll just collect zero stars then. It's actually pretty difficult. Because all the stars are moving, I get it. But if you time it at just the right time, I'm not going to lead it. With no issues. I'm not saying the star, but like the candy. We have a new winner. Yes. But it doesn't end here. We go even further. Level 75. Oh. And there are even more locations and more friends to discover. <laughs> yeah. It's kind of like a little house. Or kind of like a little trap. Sorry, um, collect one star. Now that's something I really like to do. It's kind of difficult. Collecting one star is almost impossible for me. Because you're always going to get that one star above Om Nom. No matter how many tries you do it, the candy will still be... will still make you frustrated and will make you collect one star. It will force you. But just like the original Cut the Rope game, 
there's that yellow firefly that will always help you. That's just so nice. Oh, how did the kitty not even get the star? I was trying to time it right. But thanks, uh, thanks anyways, Firefly. Your hints let me true. Well, you are uh, the hints, but <laughs> doesn't matter. Level 76. All right, so this is a moving material. All right. Then just let us bounce the candy. There we go. Let's see if I could try collecting 37 fruits. Okay. Okay. The survey says it's looking pretty good so far. Are you kidding me? I only collected 34 fruits. Okay, in that case, the survey says it's not going well. Oh! But this time it is. All right. Collect one star under three seconds. I was able to do that. All right. Level 77. Then we'll go to a different level in the city park. This one is interesting. There is another level with yet another pair of tosses. Another two tosses. So you have to bounce the candy and nom nom at the same time so that the candy does not bounce like this. So, yeah, that's why you have to, like, collect all the stars and then bounce both of these at the same time. Like, all of them and the candy at the same time so that the candy will not fall. Collect two stars in under five seconds. That's pretty cool. Wait, no. All right. Ooh, two seconds. New record. Let's go. Yes, yay, yes. Now, this level is kind of interesting. Level 81. And when I say it's interesting, I'm not kidding. Wait, I didn't even collect a star yet. You cheeky candy. Then the last star from Om Nom. When the pole becomes unbalanced, immediately bounce the candy because it will go straight to Om Nom side. Let me show you another example. The thing is, Om Nom is putting so much weight that if you bounce Om Nom with it, it might also work, but it might be time consuming like this. Om Nom will not really get the stars on time and trying this. Even if Om Nom did collect all the stars, it's impossible for you to get the candy. Om Nom will always bounce back to the spring, no matter how much weight he puts in. Unless you're a superhuman, then you would be able to do this. See? That's impossible. That's what I meant. Or you could just do that. Yeah! Collect one star. You're kidding me. You have to time it at the right time. No! Alright. It's weird how I'm trying to get one star and not all three stars. Probably because three stars is just the star medal, and one star is just the challenge medal. What? Yo, are you serious, bro? Oh, wait, yeah, you have to type it right. I forgot. Just kidding, guy. Don't forget about that. Alright, level 86. The first level that introduces you to a trigger button switch, which makes the material move. That's why this red gear in the material is here. Yeah, that's why it's here. Get all three stars. Collect one star. I don't know how we're gonna do this. All right, let me see. No, not two stars. I need one. All right. Let's see if I can actually do this. Ugh. Come on. Uh, not two stars again. What am I gonna do? Oh, uh, I know. Uh, still, I got two stars? Man, this is tricky. I thought my plan was really gonna work for a second. Oh! 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 I thought the candy was gonna fall down, but it slided to Omnom all the way over there. 
No, I didn't expect that. Level 88. Oh my gosh. Now the whole entire... Now the whole entire, like, playset... The whole entire Omnom and the whole entire Toss are both moving to Garden. Yeah, collecting three stars is a really difficult move. But once you practice a lot, it's going to be a breeze. It's going to be really easy now. Like a piece of cake. Wait, no! Alright, I think I'll handle it from here. Alright. Then just, yeah, collect all the fruits. Collect as many fruits as you can. Yeah. Yeah. Collect three stars in under six seconds. Don't worry, I can take care of that. Three, two, one. Oh, I hit zero. That means I didn't complete the mission. That's okay. We just need to go faster. Come on. And, uh, I'll probably fail it. Or will I? No, I fail it. All right. One. Come on. Two. One. Yeah, there we go. Yes, yes, yes. Level 89, but we'll go to the next location. All right. It's, it's just like a little car for Omnob. Like a cute little car. All right. We did it. This one's too easy. All we need to do is just do that in a breeze. All right, let's go to the this place, level ninety-seven. And then there is Boo. Don't worry, this friend is not creepy. It just, yeah. <laughs> it's just that Boo has a special feature where he can scare Omnom into the air. That's so cool, right? But I promise, this this creature is not actually a jump scare or something. It's just a little bit quiet. 19 fruits or more. Like, literally. Boo is actually helpful. Boo is actually a really helpful Dobby. He's not a scary Dobby, but only Tom Dob. <laughs> Obviously, you kind of saw Tom Dob's creepy looking face. Tom <laughs> Dob's scared expression. He's like, hi! I don't want this thing near me. <laughs> Shut up and keep swallowing. All right, now that we've got Omnom swallowing this type of candy, I don't want to watch the cartoon, so let's go to level 98 and see how we're going to deal with this level. <laughs> Sorry, Omnom, but we have to scare you for a little bit. <laughs> yes. Then cut the rope, and your monster will be all set for a candy phase. Yeah, baby. Holy candy, we're actually beating those levels pretty easily. Get it, holy candy? Collect three stars. Sometimes I fail because that one star above the candy is just so hard to get. It's just so hard. <laughs> Sometimes not even move <laughs> But with just enough practice, you'll be able to get it. I've been practicing for days and days and days. And I think on one of those days, I finally got that star above the candy. I think you'll just need to be fast enough, or you might need to get more force. Either way, I think collecting stars is just a habit. You just have to try your best. Level 100! So do this one. <laughs> 100 levels down. My first, um, my first small victory. But yet there are more levels to come. Level 101! I like 101 Dalmatians. There's even a movie called 102 Dalmatians. By the way, we'll go to level 102 in a second. Right after we complete this challenge medal. Don't collect any stars and don't push any buttons. No problem. Just get Boo out of the way so that he won't make you push the button. 
then pop all the balloons rapidly. <laughs> like this. <laughs> See? That's close but successful. The baby will not be able to collect any stars due to the movement of the balloons and the involvement of no booze over here. So that the candy will not be able to collect it. Level 105. <laughs> this one is interesting too. Another button. I feel like Boo does not even do anything here. He just pushes the button. <laughs> on the yeah, I don't think I need to scare Omnom in order to. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Machines are easy, Momo. They are too easy for me to face. Alright. Two more levels of bed. Oh my gosh. Look at all those booze it licks. I almost forgot about that level. It's kind of practical too. Sorry, I'm not, but we'll have to track you and lose tons. God darn. Alright. Then you at just the right time. And I'm not more the king. Yeah. You don't need to drop him. I just dropped him from that place because I wanted to. Collect two stars. You're, you're not kidding me, man. Collect two stars? That's probably going to be a challenge. I collected two stars. How am I going to get Om Nom up here? Oh, yeah, right. You scare Om Nom. What the frick? Om Nom just fell down and collected the last star just as soon as I was succeeding. Okay, I don't think I'm gonna drop Om Nom this time. I think I'm just gonna let him stay in the air. Probably because he was too cheeky and collected the last star. Finally, there we go. Alright, this one, and then we'll go to the fruit market. Hey, wait, no! Okay, needed to retry that level again. Because I didn't get that top star. Oh, great. Like I said, levels take a long time for this. Oh, finally, I did it. There we go! Alright. Now let's go to the scrumptious, delicious, resisting fruit market. Level 121. Snail brow. Or is it snail bro? I think it's snail brow, but it might be snail bro. You might never know. I hate that kind of rhyme. You have to tap him to make him go. Yes. He carries candies, even Om Nom, and even anything else just along with him. Under five seconds. Oh, I could do that pretty easily. World record, three seconds. Nobody could do greater than three seconds time. It's only the possible record in any way. Same thing with 122. Tap him to stop. Like this, tap him to stop. Yeah. There we go. But that's it. I'm not moving the candy due to Roto. Beat the timer. Don't use Roto's hat. Are you kidding me? This is impossible. Roto is literally carrying me. How am I supposed to beat the challenge medal? All right, if you say so. Okay. Roto is still carrying on them. I don't understand. I think I'm going to fail. What? How did I succeed? Oh, I didn't drop Om Nom. I got it. I get it. So you don't drop Om Nom. It's physically impossible to drop Om Nom, so this level is actually pretty easy. Wow. I never knew how to do it that way. Level 123. Easy. I'm one, two, three. Well, for beginners, this will pretty much not be easy. But through practice, you'll be able to complete it in a breeze. You, you'll just need to practice. Just like I said, you'll need to practice. Like this. There we go. There we go. All right. There we go.
go. Just do this level over here above the pineapple. I love the pineapple setting. Oh. All right. This oh. one's kind of mediocre and challenging. <laughs> oh, Om Nom's falling down. But don't worry. He's falling down in a good way. He needed to collect that tower, so that's actually brilliant. All right. Hold on. Let, let me see. Okay, so... Oh, I get it. All right. Then let him go at the right time, and he'll eat the candy bowl. Yeah, baby. I'm acing this. I'm, ace, I'm, I'm acing it. I, I aced it. My gosh. Oh. <gasps> There's a boo here. There's a boo in this level. Man, this mm. level totally stumped me. You cannot believe how I just stumped it. And pretty much mm. failed this entire level. <laughs> the thing that was so difficult was timing it right. But I've practiced a lot and I eventually beat the level with no issues. No issues at all. Let's go to another location after this level 143 oh. and my god can't you imagine how hard this level would be if you didn't know how to do it that would be a nightmare that would be an absolute nightmare if you didn't know how to do it try my best not really but yeah, just wanted to show you. Then after this... Oh, another one. I'm sorry, guys. How about we just use that Firefly again? The Firefly is always helpful. I don't know why I did not use hints for level 143 instead of level 144. That level should have been really hard. Oh! That's how you do it. Then magnetize. Oh. I'm starting to understand it now. See, that magnet cannot retouch the candy again because it's eaten by Om Nom. All right. Now let's go to the bakery. This is the bakery, level 145. Bakery is the last location. You'll find Ginger, our last helpful friend here. If you cut the rope where Ginger is in, or the rope, which is the only rope here in this level, then Ginger can burn away stuff. I mean, she is fire after all, so she burn this board off. Yeah, see how she burned it off? Yeah. All right. I don't want to watch the cartoon, but thanks for suggesting me the cartoon. It's really kind of you. Zeptolab, I understand if you need advertisements to make money, or even cartoons, I'm assuming. But if you keep showing people ads or cartoons like a billion times per day, but I don't think this game will even work out at all. I mean, I asked my mom to pay the bundle with the Avenue ads and infinite sun energy over here. That's why I was wearing a crown. So you see, over here, this is infinite sun energy. Just let me show you real quick. Yeah, there are candy coins. There are hints. There are power-ups, even. Like bombs, teleporters, and balloons. And customization. You see that little sun thing over here? That's the limit until Om Nom has been tired. But since I have the crown, and since I let Mommy buy it for me... I have infinite energy. And so my Om Nom will never get tired. So just know that trick, okay? All right, let's go to a difficult one, level 152. Oh, my gosh. This one is very difficult if you don't have the skills. But I've practiced this for a really long time, and now I'm a professional at it. I'm a pro. Yeah. Being a con is a fat chance because I have now been so conquered to the Om Nom Quest universe. Or the cave universe, as I can say. Pretty much the world surrounding Om Nom. 
Wow, <laughs> you cheeky om nom. I didn't even collect the two of her stars yet. Yeah, don't worry. At least you get a very high score. 14,257. Wow. Collect two stars. Cut two ropes. Wow, I wonder how I do it. Maybe it could be the same thing we just did. Oh, wait, no. This is my last rope I have to cut. This is this was the last rope. All right. Wait, wait, I think I might know how to beat the level. Yes, yes, yeah, there we go. Level 158. Mm, I can't do this one. But hey, at least I can show you a blooper. You wanna know the easiest way to fail a level just like this? <laughs> just like, it just like burns off and then Toss just falls off immediately. And then Om Nom will like beg you for candies even more, even though you're unable to because you might think it's impossible. Yeah, but the magnets are really helpful too. They like magnetize candies and other objects and well, it pretty much only magnetizes the candy, but, you know, still really helpful in some sort of way. There is the other level. And then, once we compare this to level 165, look at that. Look at that. Oh, uh, Ginger just died. So, uh, you know how I said she's fire? Well, fire gets um, put out when she's in water, like this water below the air cushions. So you have to watch out, otherwise this will happen. Ginger will burn, not burn, I mean, she will disintegrate to death because there's water in it. Not again. You have to keep the fire safe. Come on, To burn this part so that Omnam can break free. Otherwise, without the fire, how will Omnam get out? Yeah, so these levels are pretty random, but they're still strategical and fun in some sort of way. Alright, the last level, the time has come, level 168. What the heck? I literally completed this with no stars. Collect one star, don't push buttons. I actually used to achieve this. No, that's zero stars. Not again. No, I pushed a button. Rats. Wait, no, that's not right. on the bounce up to the other star. Come on. No, I pushed a button, don't it? Oh, only one star. All right. Click the next button to see your championship final. This is the ending scene. From Evan's house, to the forest, to the junkyard, to the other places, and then Om Nom eats so much candies that he has so far, and literally has his mouth wide open in the ending. And we have a new grand cha 19 out of 24 achievements completed, Lex, because why not? Alright, well I learned that feeding a candy monster and starting a quest as one needs to be done real fast for challenges and certain ones too and for certain stars that might be difficult coming soon man that update is always lying it's not coming soon don't don't trust the update the spiders are cheeky anyway i hope you enjoyed this episode of cut the rope 2 until next time stay on the happy side of life and much love from luke georges which is me of course